All right, 713 right now. This Thursday is National Get Smart About Credit Day. Richard Butts from Bank of Hawaii joins us this morning. Morning, Richard. Good to be back. So but you and a bunch of your colleagues, you're actually going to get out of the bank, go into the high schools, teach some of the kids. Uh, what are some of the lessons that you hope to get across to them? Yeah, in just a couple days, we've got about 80 bankers going out to 22 high schools across the state to talk to them about making smart credit and borrowing choices. Yeah. Okay, so a lot of these kids are about to get their hands on some plastic uh, and, and learn some very troubling lessons about credit. Where, where do you even begin to start? What, what are well, we're going to focus on two of the five financial core competencies, is what they were called. Uh, ben Bernanke, the chairman of the Fed, shared that with us um, at a roundtable in Washington about a couple months ago with the National Teachers Association. And, and so he said these five things today's youth need to be educated in before they graduate, so mm -hmm. we're going to help with that. So the first is on income mm -hmm. and how you uh, earn it and ways in which you can earn more. The second is on how you spend it, so setting that smart budget. The third is saving and investing for the future, but it's the fourth, the uh, smart credit decisions, the borrowing, mm -hmm. that we're really going to focus on, as well as the fifth, which is the uh, protecting the first four. So making sure that we're making the smart choices, making sure that we're protecting our income, protecting our savings. That's good, because a lot of these kids know how to borrow. They don't know how to pay back. That's kind of the right. big part of that. Um, how, do you, how do you hope to get your, your message across? I mean, they have short attention spans, you know? Well, as you know, <laughs> Halloween's coming, right. coming up, okay. right? So rather than bringing the rubber mass and the fake blood, mm -hmm. we figure what we'll do is we'll share horror stories uh -huh. with them about you know what can happen horrifically if you miss your payments uh -huh. or you're late on a payment or you max out a credit card and just walk out on it, how horrific that could be for you in the future when you're trying to buy a house or buy a car. And it can be horrific. It can be absolutely you know, horrific. We talk about it all the time. The interest rates are at uh, historic yep. lows right now. Is that going to be play it in, into this at all? You well, it's definitely made the okay. news, right? Yeah. The rate environment that we continue to find ourselves in. So we'll, we'll address that a little bit. But more importantly, we'll discuss with them that having good credit and making good credit decisions builds you up for the future. No matter what the rate environment is, if you have good credit, you will be at the bottom of the interest rate pile, therefore saving the most money of all of your peers. There you go. Richard Butts, Bank of Hawaii, thank you very much. Good to be Have fun. Sounds interesting. All right. We're going to have more information about this on our website, hawaiinewsnow.com. Howard.